Okay, so how do we go to here? From here, from here, and from here. If you want to find out, then stay tuned because we're going to give you the beginner and intermediate version of how to get to close embracement in bachata. And we have a little bonus for you, so stay tuned. You ready? Let's go! <laughs> channel or if you're new welcome my name is Dalia Telao I'm a professional Latin dancer and I specialize in salsa and bachata and this is my student Chuck Chuck <laughs> thank you Chuck for being here today so truth is that he asked me a question and out of this question I said hey let's make it a video because uh, it's possible that a lot of you are asking yourselves the same question how to get to the close embracement yeah if you find yourself here and here and you cannot just be like, ah, right? <laughs> so it has to be a little bit smooth. Okay, so for number one, we're on the open position or double hand hold, yes? The beginner's version of it will be just to do a, a simple left turn and uh, we're gonna demonstrate, actually, I'm gonna turn this way so you guys can see, ready? So we are doing two angles, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, you raise the hand on four and then you lead her into a regular turn. But please pay attention to Chuck's right arm because he's going to be tracing uh, my back to get into that close frame smoothly. So we go five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, and now we are automatically there. Okay, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And why is it intermediate? Because we're now going to be creating more dynamic, yeah, by switching spots. Uh, I'm sure you are familiar with the, uh, how do you call that, the crossbody lead? <laughs> yes, and if not, then um, we're gonna explain it really, really quick. So we're gonna be here, we go, one, two, step back, and four. On four he's preparing for the turn, yeah, and then the concept here is to switch places. So we go five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, you guys, so now we're gonna go to the second one, which is from the handshake hold, yeah? I think if we do it this way, it would be probably better for you. Uh, so you can see what's happening with the hand. Yeah, we're gonna do it three angles then. Only because I'm in a good mood. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, so we're here, we go. Same concept as the first one, which is the turn to the left, but now we're in different hold. Ready and go. One, two, three, four. We understand the turn there. Yeah, we go. Five, six, on seven, he's already uh, got putting the hand over his head. We call it a loop and then he releases the hand to get close to me. Okay, now let's do it uh, from this angle. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. 
another angle. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna do it again with the switching places or crossbody lead. We go slow. One, two, three, four. Remember, now the concept here is gonna be to switch places. So he needs to pull me before the turn. We go five, six, and then the loop on seven gets close, eight. All right, from a different angle. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. And now from here, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, guys, now for the third option, which is coming from the close frame. Let's see what the beginner option brings us. So we're here, and then we're gonna do a rock step. We go five, six, seven, on eight. If you notice, he's already preparing the hand, yeah? Kind of like, like copying it in to go into a flick. So we go one, two, and we keep the connection there. Yeah, we finish it with the basic of five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Different angle. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Basically, what we're doing here is the 180, or we can call it backspot turn as well. So we go seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This time we're gonna do it in four angles because of the hand, I really need you to pay attention on that. Six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, guys, so now we got to our last one before the bonus. Remember, we still have a bonus, so don't go anywhere. And uh, again, a quick reminder that if you are liking what you're seeing right now, please show some love and support by liking and subscribing to my channel. All right, now that being said, uh, let's go ahead and review the last one before the bonus. And we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. From here, we do a body roll. And now we are set in this sitting position which is very useful when you wanna do some other work like upper body movements or even uh, the hip uh, action there. All right guys, so now this is the bonus because you stay all the way until the end. And this one, I call it the pro version only because you have to be ready to, to do this one. This one requires a little bit more of uh, playing with the music which is the musicality, yeah, and, and having a lot more confidence to really like go for it. And I believe you got it. So let's go ahead and do it. So we're here and this, we use it mostly during the intro, yeah, uh, because it's, it's a good way to start, you know, when the music is a little bit slower, you don't want to be just like dancing, okay? All right, let's go ahead. So first, if you notice, he's tracing my hands yes my arms to get to pick them up and then we just do arm work right there and we stay into the close frame at the moment we connect he is indicating if he wants me to settle or if he wants whatever he's going to do next he sets the preparation all the time but that's another topic for another video yes we still have to talk about the connection and all of that for now we're just giving you the options to get into the close embracement and that's it you guys so let's do it one more time from this side okay. with confidence trace my arms hands up and settle beautiful okay now one more time let's do it from this angle okay. this time Beautiful. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. 
And remember, please show some love and support by liking and subscribing to my channel. And also, if you feel like this was helpful to you, go ahead and share with your friends and family. Thank you so much and thank you, Chuck, for your help. My pleasure. And uh, see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.